hello and welcome back to Vambrace. Time to head out. <laughs> hey, what's up, mister? Oh, he's the leader? Makes sense. Vaspar, that's exactly the guy we need. Uh, yeah, just pull the thingy. We're going. You really should get uh, prop pants. Let's go. So I'm not exactly sure how we're gonna go about this. I suppose the only way we're gonna make uh, final progress we're gonna lock into our progress if we just get to the end of the entire um, whatever this thing is. You can retreat to the lock at any given time. Uh, yeah, we're getting the same tip again. You'll keep surviving allies loot, but lose your expedition progress. Find reliable shelters between neighbors, neighborhoods to craft and use items. Unfortunately, your team will be exposed and unable to rest here. Right. Okay. So, the goal here is just to get stuff and retreat. So, the goal is not necessarily to make progress at this point, but to get stuff. All right. But yeah, we do want to make progress, but also get stuff. Oh, we can rest already? That doesn't really worth it here. That, that would be nice to find later, but we're not going to do it now. We are, we are completely at max. This seems like a... okay. So he is not completely useless at this. Stuff! I don't know what that is. You find a working uh, pipe uh, jutting from the ground. Warm steam hisses from a ruptured section of the steel. The fact that this ancient system still functions is a testament to the ingenuity of its original engineers. Upon closer examination, you find an old valve that looks like it can control the pressure. Why would I want to mess with it, though? Don't mess with it? Yes. Uh, I don't think we have anything to gain here. We are at maximum. I don't know what we would gain other than maybe like a... Um, I have no idea. Peace of mind? Oh, we went the wrong way. We don't want to go this way. Hopefully we're not going to lose some points for this, but we did. Seems like we did. Okay. Uh, maybe we're gonna take the long road. I don't know if it's worth it. Like, is there like a rule that if it's out of the way, then you're gonna find stuff? You encounter an old leather bound tome. It lays upon an ornate bookstand. The inscriptions running along its pages beckon you to read it. Uh, I don't know. I guess we're gonna read it. What can we gain? Alexandra? You read it. Paspa reads it. I don't know. Whoever has the highest spirit. We don't know now. Uh, I don't... I, let's make Vaspa read it. You scan through the tome's old pages and discover spells scrawled in an unknown but legible language. You read a few passages along and feel an eerie sensation surround you. Your actions may have summoned something terrifying. Terror 10! Uh oh. Terror went up, so maybe we shouldn't dick around anymore. We need plan B here right away. Try to make a beeline for the exit. No more dicking around. No fights yet. Oh. Such a simple ambush. Ambush techniques cannot fool a Shadow Master. Wait, what? Did we... Did we avoid a fight? Or did we get an advantage in a fight? Okay. So a lot of them will come pretty damn soon. I can't kill the Noble, which is a little annoying. I can make everyone bleed.
Make everyone take damage. And, and they're gonna act soon. Maybe we're gonna do the poison everybody. Move. I, I imagine when they come, they're gonna get attacked at the start of their turn. And this is... Protective Light. Protect two allies. Oh. Wait. How can you protect yourself? Barrier status. Any damage received by these allies is re reduced by three, I suppose. Okay, I get it. But I really don't like that skill. I thought that worked differently. This is that's not a good skill. <laughs> I don't like it. You gotta get fired. <laughs> Well, that's nice, but she spent a turn, well, not only doing nothing. I like that skill. Imagine if she killed something instead. Or at least she could have a better ultimate, I don't know. That wasn't terribly impressive. Though they took damage, not because of her. Uh, we can hit the bard. I don't need to use the ability now. The bard is gonna take one... Oh, actually, that's not good enough. Alright, finishing blow here. On the bard. And he's just gonna die to the poison, right? Because it triggers at the start. Alright. Alright, uh, not too bad. Take their stuff. All their stuff. Every time. I suppose that's... Yeah. The portal for all. It... It worked. Oh, that's not good. Wait. You? That's befuddled. Oh. That's not great. Uh, can we check the status of this? Hmm. Apparently we can't. But I do see the effect of it. We just lost the... Uh, scavenging skills. I need to go... Straight ahead, actually. We don't want to go down. Wait, what is this? Oh, that goes down to the cellar, right? We don't want to go to the cellar. We just want to go straight ahead and finish this, uh, finish this uh, section of the map as soon as possible. All right, Vesper. Oh, only three dudes. We can't kill anything instantly. The security guard actually. Deals quite a lot of damage. You can't kill that guy. But if he double up on him, possible. Let's do that. Mm, not the best. Let's go for the killing blow. This way we are preventing two damage. damage though. Wait. He didn't avoid it. Did he? So if he can kill the dancer... Oh, actually I hit the wrong one. By mistake. He only deals two damage. Am I just gonna kill the security guard now? Yeah. we are doing that. Finishing blow on the security guard. <gasps> miss! Oh, that's a miss too. He's killed the security guard. That's fine. I 
think we need to replace Alondra. Other than that, we're good. I would get more attached to them, but it seems like I need to swap them out quite a bit. Okay, just fights. Wait, am I going the wrong, wrong way again? I think we came from the right. Oh yeah, we did. Please, see the... Okay. We avoided the mushroom spores. That's nice. I wonder if we're gonna get better. Because that uh, befuddled is not helping us. Obviously. Oh, stuff. We're not gonna find a lot of stuff because... Yes. We can't... Cannot do it. Ah. Uh, oh, we can rest. Uh, we can't rest for too long, though. Let's say Bora Kang does it. Terry's going up quite a bit. Uh, yes. Let's raise the Terry by a little bit. Success. Terror went up by a lot. I don't think we're gonna rest anymore. I just let just end it. Because I don't wanna fight super demons, super ghosts, non-stop. I think I learned my lesson at this point, and uh, that is uh, not something I plan on doing. No, steep crevice. Uh oh. Damn it, he broke his leg too. What the hell is this? Oh, take the stuff. Oh, <gasps> foot planks! No way! Oh, a fancy pillow. Damn. A storehouse. Okay. Bag of seeds. Maybe that's actually good. Uh, probably not. Come on. Where would you use the seeds? Seems. Oh. We triggered the terror, but maybe we actually avoided it. If I slept for one, one, one more, like, stress relief, it would have uh, guaranteed that we're gonna fight. Wait, what is that? We can, we can rest there? Northern Shelter? What the hell is this? Was this always here? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Can I just end this? There's nothing to do other than cancel this. And also craft. This is the workshop. You can craft value new items here. Some of which cannot be purchased from merchants. You will need resources to craft new items. When you have what you need in your inventory, the option to craft will be available. Okay, so this is probably why I shouldn't sell everything. I can get herbal... Oh, what? Do I need to find the recipe too? Um, a lot of high fives. Figure two, figure four. This is the only way to do it. Trickster belt. Oh, wow. You do need to find stuff for this. Uh, wow. Okay. Divining rod. Okay. So these are usable. But obviously, we need a lot more stuff for this. Oh yeah, this is the camping kit that I didn't buy. <laughs> this would have helped us so much. But I can craft it, if you get enough stuff. Fine vest. But I suppose the reason is that we can't really keep a lot of stuff. We kind of need to sell it. Oh, I do have a simple vest. So we can upgrade it. What else we have? Oh no, consumables, consumables and relics, that's all. Uh, sure. I guess we're just gonna end this camping.
We didn't. Yeah. There was really no point to it, apparently. Or was there a point to it? It doesn't seem like we got any farther. Hmm. It seems like this workshop is just like a generic thing. I don't know where we want to go. At least this thing is lit up. Hospital area. I could use that. Maybe we're just gonna go straight ahead. No, please. Spill the enemy's blood without mercy. Yeah, they really showed up. They got the fancy horse. That's actually not too good. Killing the police would be pretty good. Oh, they're gonna come pretty damn soon. We don't have a way to kill the police. I guess we're just gonna poison every one of them. That has a very high potential damage, but realistic damage is pretty low. I don't know if we want to go for the double shield, but I guess we're gonna attempt it. I'm not a huge fan of this skill. The enemies are not stupid. We're just gonna hit the guys in the back now. Oh, what? Oh, going for the big boost. Oh, they, they are protected. They take less damage. Okay, fine. We can go for the damage everybody. Hey, does this work the same way? Yeah, deal to... Two true damage to all targets, so I'm not sure why I'm actually given an option here. Okay, so our caster ghost will die. The police is not dying just yet. Hmm. Wait, I'm actually wrong about this shield. This shield not only, not only, uh, is kind of crappy because you know. They might ignore you, but also, this is a temporary hit point thing, not a permanent damage re reduction. Hmm. I guess we're just gonna go crazy here. I don't want to take hits. Poison! Good poison. Rest in peace, horse. And you, ghosty. He's gonna die to the poison. Poison is good! Because it triggers before. Wait. Will she keep her shield? I don't think she will. Else it would make sense to trigger the shield after the fight. So you can actually have a, a free shield for the next fight. Well, we can go this way. It would be five. If we go this way, this could be. This could be even shorter. That's kind of four, four, either way. I'll just go uh, straight ahead. I don't know if the rooms have some logic to them. Oh, yeah, we're just taking all the stuff. Planks. Junk. Also, it would be nice to know how do we get recipes. Is it just ba based on the state of the game? Or do I, do I need to actually find it? I suppose you need a, a guy with high, high merchantry. For sure. Just to have the option. Oh, trade. Hello, warm blood. Let's make a deal. Sounds good to me. So, are you selling any... Are you selling crap? We can... can use these healings, but... I don't know if I'm terribly interested in all of these. We can get a fur vest, 200. Ah, but this is such a tough one to justify. Merchantry 1 for minus 1 combat. 
Ah, dowsing rod. Again, minus one combat. How do you justify that? Just for awareness. I mean, I don't know. Very tough to justify. Fair vest. I mean, this is a pretty easy one. You know, you get max health and vigor. So this is not, not a tough one to justify. Maybe not the best. Because, like, that's just maximum health. It's a little bit of maximum health. But it, it doesn't really hurt. I might want to buy this, but who knows. Maybe I don't want to buy this. I can also try to sell my own stuff. I got a lot of crap, but maybe... Maybe we're just gonna be... Careful about this. And we're gonna sell our crap after the journey. So do I buy a fur vest here? I think this is a safe choice. This is just a very slight, very slight boost to the to one of my uh, guys. But also, uh, there are, there are other better options like combat one. That's gonna be clearly better than health max four because that's gonna affect every turn, and this is just. Yes, like, this is not as great. I don't know, maybe I'm just gonna not buy this. But what the hell am I waiting for here? I don't know. 200 is not that much, of, not that much, so I'm gonna buy it. Wait, I actually bought one, he has more? I can only buy one though. At least we are only buying one. Uh, let's give it to Vosper. Wait, actually work? Totally expected it to not work. So he has a fur vest on. For some height, I recall that uh, you can't give your companion stuff. Yeah, it actually shows that this is a storage room, and that's what uh, and that was the storage room. Then this was the merchant. All right. Wait, does this mean anything? That Indian head? I don't know. Um. Oh! Camping spot! And we actually have... Wait, whoa, 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 what's going on here? Our spirits are... I don't know. Shouldn't underestimate that. Aura Kang is gonna cheer us up a little bit. Aura! Sing us a song! Five Terror. Yeah, let's do that. I don't think you have a choice here. I suppose... Now, the question is, do I wanna rest and uh, gain a little bit of life? Life terror? I think we gotta do it. Because we still have a, a little headroom here. But we're not gonna screw around for too long. But we should have plenty of time. To end this. Yeah. Uh, where are we going though? Isn't this the exit? And this should be the exit. Yeah, we're not screwing around. We're just going to the exit right away. Yeah, we're in the right place. Like some kind of cinema in the back. Ooh. Progress has been made. Anyway, this is a good time to take a break. Maybe we can actually save our progress somewhere, but that's just wishful thinking. Who knows? Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.